Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay. Are you okay? Not bad, thank you. How about you? Okay. Um, I'm tired. All right. So it's our last week. So sorry, last last week, right? We yes. talk about um, reading skill. So any questions? Show any homework? Yeah. Any homework um, or any new words? Um, no homework and some new words. What is this? Um, there is flop, floppy disk. Là cái điểm mềm ạ. Refund là hoàn tiền. Rather cộng với với nguyên ạ. What? Uh, would rather. Uh, as verb infinitive. Okay. Exhibition là. Exhibition. Uh, là buổi triển lãm ạ. Uh, digital là kỹ thuật số. Digital. 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 Okay. Uh, set off là khởi hành. That's right. Change one's mind là thay đổi ý nghĩ của một ai đó. Put on. I think it's keen on bằng với keen to là thích ạ. Keen on là ham mê. To one surprise. To one surprise. Làm thế nào đó bất ngờ ạ. Okay, now today we will study about the part four. We're reading skill, okay? So this part from question 21 to 25. Let's read the text and questions below. For each question, let's mark the correct letter A, B, or C. Okay, this is multiple choice. Okay. All right, now let's take a picture about these questions. Okay. All right. Now you read the text and answer the questions below. Okay. Okay. Any new words? Mm, 
I think I need some time to read. I mean, it was? Mm, yes. What is this? Uh, defeat. I'm divided, okay. Defeat, đánh bại. What else? This. Glamour. 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 West. Quyến rũ. Okay. Hào hóa. Bond leaping, bond leaping, trái phiếu nhảy vọt. With this Q less already ridiculous the good okay. Bond, that you did. Okay. Uh -huh. 
Oh, ice plotting. Yes. Why it's easy. What it is? It's plotting what? Boom, no. Give it a stem. Okay. Finish? Yes. Now, what is Jessica trying to do in her essay? Um, C. Describe how Daniel played for the part of James Bond. So, give a balanced view of a Bond film she has seen. What can a reader write down from Jessica essays? I think it's B. B? Yes. This is D. Where is it? She thinks Daniel Craig is the best James Bond. What does Jessica tell us about Craig? Is a new Bond film? I think it's A. A? Right. He performs some of the action scenes. Why is one problem with the film, according to Jessica? Mm -hmm. C. C? B. It's sometimes hard to understand what's happening. Oh, okay. Which of these might appear in a magazine review of the new Bond film? A. A. C. C. I'm not sure the title. The title tells how you much, but be prepared to watch a rather different kind of Bond movie. All right. Okay. Any question? It's quite difficult for me. Okay. Try hard, okay? Now, let's read the text below and choose the correct word for each space. Example. Number zero. Last year, my dad got a new job. It was in a town. 
which weighs 100 grams the material from our home okay, okay. now okay. take a picture Okay. okay, now you read and to the best answer, okay? Okay. Finish? No? 26? Mm, B. Okay, I decided. 27? D. What? Uh, travel. Travel? Yes. Right. 28? C. Yeah, 29. A. 30. D. 31. D. This is B after, not later. Okay. 22, sorry, 32. Mm, C. Yes, 33. B. 34. Uh, A. Uh, 35 is C. Okay, we have new words nervous, disappointed, angry, bored. Okay, without it. Okay. All right. Now, any question? Was this? No. Easy, right? Yes. All right. This is the end of the reading skill. Now we move to writing skill. Okay. Now writing task one. There is some 
the, some information about this writing test. In writing, we have three parts. Okay. okay. All right. So in part one is a sentence transformation. Part two is short communicative message, postcard, email notes. Okay. Okay. And part three is the choice between an inform an informal letter or a story. For task okay. one. You complete sentences to rewrite by original sentences so that the meaning is the same, but a different structural pattern is used. And they must use no more than three words to complete their sentences. Part two is write between 35 and 45 words. This is a communicating the content place give, given in the task. Part three, write about 100 words answering the questions of their choosing. Candidates are assessed using four sub skills the content, the communicative, the achievement, the organizations, and language. Okay. Now, part one. Here, some sentences about a game. For each question, they complete the second sentence so that it means the same as the first. Use no more than three words, okay? Then write okay. only the missing words on your answer sheet. Okay. Example, the game's equal daughter. The name of the game is Jotter. This is the example. No more than three words. Understand? Yes. Part one, always easy. Okay. So how to approach this task? Then read the first sentence and think about its meaning. Okay. Second, read the second sentence, look at which words are, pre are repeated from the first sentence and which words are different. Okay. Look at the second sentence again and think about which phrases and structures could be used to complete it. And the first, it complete the second sentence using one, two or three words, okay? okay. Five, read both sentences again check their meanings in the, is the same. All right, now let's do the part task one. Yes.
Okay. Finish? Yes. Number one, you can only play Jato. If there are at least two players. As if or when. Number two, you can play Jato in a team or on. Your own. Your own. On, okay, on. I enjoyed the game and so. Uh, so do my parents. So do my parents. My friends said, said I have never played. I have never played Jordan. This is a um, reporter speech. Yes. Shall sure. so we play the game now? So we play the game now. Okay, understand it? Yes. All right. Now we study about the conditional sentences. Okay. So in conditional sentences, we have four types of this. Okay. Okay. The first is the general conditional. It is used to talk about things that are generally true or scientific facts. Okay. Cái này là sử dụng. Tôi điều kiện loại không sử dụng để nói về một vật mà làm sao nó generally true nó luôn đúng hoặc là một sự thật khoa học. Okay. We have two part in conditional. Okay. Every conditional have two parts. Okay. Part one is if clause, and part two is main clause. Okay. In general conditional, if clause, okay, if clause is in present simple tense, main clause is in present simple tense. It means okay. in if clause we use if, okay, yes. and the clause is in present simple tense. Okay. Tức là chúng ta chỉ thêm if vào thôi. Còn lại mệnh đề chính và mệnh đề điều kiện đều ở thí hiện tại đơn. Okay. First conditional sentences. Câu điều kiện loại 1. Used to talk about possible condition and is prob prob probable result in the future. Câu điều kiện loại 1 sử dụng để diễn tả một hành động có thể xảy ra hiện tại hoặc là ở trong tương lai. In if clause is in present simple, it look like general conditional. But in main clause, we use the structure will add infinity verb in infinity. Okay. This main subject Sorry, if at the verb in or if at subject, sorry, if at subject, at verb in present symbol, at object. Main clause A, subject, at will or can or sure okay. or may. At verb. The main verb is in infinity and at object. Okay. Understand? Yes. Now, cấu trúc là if này. Mệnh đề điều kiện trước nhá, if clause trước nhá, là if này cộng chủ ngữ rồi đến cộng đến động từ động từ này chia ở thì hiện tại đơn, tức là thêm as hoặc is yes, hoặc là động từ to be. Okay. okay. Understand. Okay. Yes. Okay. Còn main clause, mệnh đề chính sẽ là chủ ngữ cộng will cộng can cộng sure cộng may cộng với động từ okay. nguyên thể. Okay. Next one is second conditional. Câu điều kiện loại hai used to talk about an unlikely or hypothetical condition and is 
probable result now or in the future tức là okay. câu điều kiện loại hai sử dụng để nói về một sự thật không có thật ở hiện tại okay. không thể xảy ra được ở hiện tại hoặc trong tương lai understand yes. không có thật ở hiện tại và nó trái ngược với thực tế ở hiện tại yes. rồi now for the structure is if at subject at okay. verb and verb year is in past simple tense okay. main clause is subject at would or would or could should might and at okay. verb in infinitive okay here okay. verb in infinitive okay understand yes. cũng vẫn là theo cấu trúc như vậy chúng ta chỉ khác mỗi thì ở mệnh đề điều kiện thôi ở mệnh đề điều yeah. kiện của câu loại một là hiện tại đơn còn ở câu loại hai là quá khứ đơn okay, okay và ở bên kia thì chúng ta chỉ chia quá khứ của cái động từ quyết thiếu thôi. Yeah. And the third conditional is used to talk about Okay, third conditional is used to talk about an imaginal condition and is topped it probable result in the past tức là okay. câu điều kiện loại 3 sử dụng để diễn tả một hành động không có thật ở trong quá khứ okay. the main clause is in past perfect okay. and main clause is in would have a participle Or this is if claw is past perfect main claw is in a, is in a present perfect yes understand yes nhưng mà ở đây chúng ta chỉ có have thôi nha không có has okay vẫn là if cộng chủ ngữ cộng động từ đó ký quá khứ hoàn thành. Understand? Yes. Okay, bắt đầu hết. lên lớp 10 sẽ học đảo ngữ của câu điều kiện lúc đó sẽ không còn ít nữa bạn đảo ngữ này thì cũng dễ với lại lại con dạy cấp 3 nên là cái kiến thức thì con cũng được dạy hết lớp 12 sơ được một lần nữa okay, easy. cái pet này thì nó chỉ là ôn lại các kiến thức của kỳ thôi và nó chỉ là nâng cao liên quan đến các kỹ năng về nghe nói đọc và viết khoa học chứ nó không liên quan đến cái câu mình nhiều yeah. nó sẽ là scientific writing okay. 
Okay, we have unless equal if not. Unless is similar in meaning to if not. And it can be used instead of if not in certain types of conditional sentences. Like if, unless if followed by a present tense, a past tense or past perfect tense. We cannot use unless in questions. And we don't use will or would is a clause after unless. Okay. Unless bằng nghĩa với if not. Và nó có thể thay thế được cho cả if not ở trong một vài các loại câu điều kiện. Trong các câu điều kiện chính. Sorry. Cũng giống như if, unless thì có thể theo sau nó bởi thì hiện tại đơn, hiện tại, quá khứ đơn hay là quá khứ hoàn thành. Và chúng ta sẽ không sử dụng sử dụng unless cho câu hỏi. Nó cũng không sử dụng will hay là would ở trong mệnh đề đằng sau unless. Okay. So how to use unless? Unless at present tense is type 1 condition. With if you will not gain a high score in IELTS exam, you don't learn, okay? Example. But for unless, equivalent with unless is unless and not at will, okay? Yes. Tức là sau unless thì cũng sẽ không có will gì hết. Okay. Đây, chúng ta Okay, finish. Okay. All right. We have note by one shell in number two is on one's own. In number five, making suggestions is for structure. What about at webbing? How about at webbing? Last at verb infinitive and short with at verb infinitive. Okay. Okay. Okay, me too equals so do I. The same expression as positive statement is so at uh, auxiliary verb at subject. Okay. Auxiliary verb là trợ động từ. Now, part two, question six. Your English friend Emma has sent you some birthday money for you to buy a music CD. So you write an email to Emma in your email. You should thank Emma for the present. Say which music CD you are going to buy. And explain 
why you have chosen this city. The right 35 to 45 words on your answer sheet, okay? Okay. The assessment is more includes three content points in the answer. If they live at one content point, they cannot gain full mark. Answers okay. must be linked to the content given in the questions. Answer must fulfill all parts of the task, or they will not receive top mask. As candidates are assigned to clarify clarity of their masses, minor errors which do not impact in communication are not penalized. Okay. Okay. So for the assessment of writing part two, this is a mock scheme of writing part two. Okay. All right. So uh, I will give you the example part, okay? The same answer. And I read it, okay? And I think uh, this is the homework for you as Neglection. We will correct it again. It's easy. It looks like uh, right. The part nine in KT. KT. Okay, finish? Mm, yes. All right, uh, the election, we study about the part three, okay? okay? All right, so any question for today? Any question for today? No. Okay, so how do you feel after four Skill in PET? Mm, I think listening is the easiest skill, and reading and writing is more difficult. Okay. So, writing is more difficult than reading. Okay, writing. Mm, yes. Okay, try to do it. Okay, because it's the first time. Okay. okay, so when you want to study about the IELTS, it's more difficult than it. Okay. Very difficult. okay, and in speaking, speaking have three parts. And okay. three parts is very different with this skill, with this task, very, diff very different and very difficult. Okay, so tomorrow uh, I will move to my school and uh, I think I will fight from uh, my document files and I will send to you, okay? okay? All right, so if you don't have any questions, we will stop here today, okay? Remember, okay. do the work. Okay. Oh, sorry, do you take a picture about this topic? No. Okay. All right, let's take a picture. Yes. Okay, so we we'll stop here today, okay? Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye, teacher.